So I've got these ultimate 100% blackout screens and they're 145 by 300 centimeters. They're pretty big. That's about 58 inches tall, which is pretty standard for a window. That's a 58 inch window, coincidentally. So you can get multiple pieces out. And that's what one looks like when it's done. And it's pretty easy. Uh, here's the sheet. You just measure the width of the window. And then you take these little Velcro things. And what I do is I'm putting, if I can find it, well, I put the hook, which is the plastic one, on the window frame. And then I put one of these on top of it. And then I just take the piece from over there and just stick it up there. Well, let me show you how I do it. Okay, so I have the piece cut right there. And it's easier to cut it from the silver side because you can see the marking. I use a black Sharpie. And then on the window, well, if you can see it, so there's a little pad. It's a little sticky on this side, but this is the Velcro right there. And we'll go ahead and hang the piece up now. And there it is. Oh, yeah, there's a light leak up there, and there's a light leak right there. But you can just grab that Velcro and just pull it over a little tighter. You can see there's a little slack in there. And that will completely block out like it does around here. But this window also has uh, blinds on it, too. So it's 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and I had to turn the light on. One other thing I wanted to point out. So this is silver on one side and black on the other, right there. So if you're trying to reduce heat, you want to put the silver on the outside so it, it reflects the heat away. If it's winter time or you're in a cold climate but you're still trying to block light, put the black side out and then it'll absorb that sunlight and make that room warmer. So last thing before I go, this room, three windows. I got it out of one package and it took me 30 minutes.